The Singapore River holds a great significance and importance for Singapore and numerous buildings that surround it have been useful for many people both now and then. Old Parliament House The government used the building from 1965 to 1999. The building was initially used as a courthouse and other government offices including the land office also moved into the building. The government used the building to discuss important laws and amend them. This kept the law and order in the country. After that, it was used as a storehouse. Then, the Department of Social Welfare after World War II. This department used this building as the headquarters and brought about better lives for the people. The Fort Fullerton was a small military post that defense the land and was constructed by 1858. The Fullerton building was also significantly used for government meetings and activities to discuss social current affairs and the nation development. The Fullerton Hotel also served as a post office and was important for sorting out and delivering mail. There was a lighthouse on the Fullerton building called the Fullerton Light, which was used to guide the ships ashore and to anchor along the piers. This helped to develop the harbour of Singapore River. Last time, Fullerton was used as a Mount Zero landmark to mark distances travelled in the roads which are essential in the travel industry of Singapore. Now, it is rebuilt as a hotel. The Fullerton Hotel now has 400 rooms which act as an integral part of the tourism of the country, helping out economically and promoting the image of the country. It is a national monument of Singapore and an important one. Shop houses along the Singapore River were used for various purposes back in the days, such as housing warehouses, storing trade materials and housing. The lower level of the shop house will be either used for commerce and trading, or some owners open their mama shops there. The higher level in the shop house will be used by the owners as their residences. The shop houses stored many items as many of these are transported by boat and ships. This was important as these activities let the influx of immigrants have an income and support their lives. Now the shop houses gave way to alfresco dining, live music entertainment and nightclubs. Today the Singapore River is the venue for many public events and activities and is the hot spot for like nightlife and entertainment. These changes in continuity are important as they let the country develop and keep up with the times and remain as a country which can provide tourists and citizens alike with the services and products needed to live a happy and fulfilling life. It lets Singapore explore new opportunities and better itself as a country. We can learn from the changes in continuity that the buildings and the purpose of the buildings change according to the needs and lifestyle of the society. The buildings also hold historical importance and the monuments also signify these events that have happened in history. Thank you.